Easy or not, we're all getting out of here. Good. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll counting on it. I'll try not to go anywhere. I want all teams to outpost seals. Heads up. Get it out of the way. There's a virus, he did a little jump. Yep. Boop. Ah. Ah. And go. Lock and load. Gotcha. That's easy. There's one, two, three. Okay, and here we are. Open! Sesame! Here for the drill. Reckless. Even for you, Commander. Three, two, one. That bombing on Ilium wasn't exactly subtle. Extreme, nope. but necessary. No, it wasn't. Neither was caging Ferrin for two years. Dr. Tassoni, your interference caused all this. Ferrin betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The Drell is simply paying the price. Someone was bound to come after you for working with the Collectors. It was a mutually beneficial partnership. Your arrival is convenient. The Collector's offer still stands. Be smart. Let Farron walk out with us. You won't be walking out at all. You're quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel nowhere with fascinating at all. companions, Doctor. Thank you for bringing me Mr. Masani to Sony. His bounty from the Blue Suns is most generous. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret, while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg, a pre-space flight species quarantined to their homeworld for massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery, which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. How am I doing? <laughs> the sass on her. That I love her. She looks up at him like, oh shit. <laughs> He's huge. And there's Masani out. So now we just have to deal with this guy. Let's do it. A lot of bullets are going to be wasted during this. Just saying now. The shield's kinetically sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. Then we do this the hard way. 
Hit him now. Let me just crack my knuckles first. Yowie! The tart. Here they come. <clears throat> the key is to get him disoriented. That way you can shoot his back. So using this deployed. Trying to find his weak spots. Come on. Different pillar. Quick while he's vulnerable. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Teamwork's not working. <laughs> if you can get him to bring up that shield again, I've got an idea. Right, we'll do it. Got him. <laughs> the aura, now. I love how he just stands there while this is happening. Like, what? That is one hell of a way to die. Just want to say, Owie. calmness that she exerts here is amazing. I'd be overwhelmed. This is the Shadow Broker. The situation is under control. We experienced a power fluctuation while upgrading hardware. It disrupted communication. I, I killed the last Shadow Broker. I am now the new one. However, we are now back online. Resume standard procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next solar day. Shadow Broker, out. Goddess of Oceans. They're probably so used it's to having you. the change of you. Shadow Brokers. How? Well, 
But maybe. Everyone who's you know. ever seen him in person is dead. So. You're the new Shadow Broker. Is taking over as the Shadow Broker really a good idea? It was either that or lose everything. It is a great his idea. His great. Sources, those will really help us. Yes, With they the will. Shadow Broker's information network. I can. I can give you. I can. I'll check the power systems. How about you go lay down, my friend? It's over. It's finally. For two years. It's all right. Yeah, no kissing. No kissing. I spent two years mourning you and Farron. And now I've got you both back. I... Let's see what we've got. It's a very emotional no setting when you date Liara. No restrictions. Honestly. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here. And it's all ours. What kind of information are we talking about? I'm not sure. I'll need to go through his files. Come back later and I'll try to have some. I love romancing Liara, but All I really I want to romance to rescue uh, that other but chick in is Mass Effect 3. That part of me wants this. With the Shadow Broker's network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Come by when you have a chance. The doors are always open. I will, because I'm going to be doing something. But yeah, I love romancing the art, but I really want to romance uh, that one girl in Mass Effect 3. So... Shepard, it's so good to see you. I've set up a few terminals with information I think you'll find interesting. Take a look. Thank you. Hello, Glyph. Welcome back, Shadow Broker. What's this? That's the old broker's VI assistant. It's actually been helpful with rebuilding the network. Please let me know if I can organize anything else for you, Shadow Broker. It also thinks anyone in the room is the broker. I'll play around with the settings later. My manual is ready whenever you have a moment. Okay. Excuse me. So here is investment opportunities, which is a great thing to do. And you'll get something back from that. Just a cool little model. What does this console do? This is the video surveillance access point. I've queued up the archive footage you requested on your last visit, Shadow Broker. Aria Talok, Omega. Alright. And you can watch these, which are really fun. Fred Mazai, Citadel. Donnell Udina, Citadel. He's a very charismatic man, isn't he? Armando Bailey, Citadel. That's all that is. David Anderson, Citadel. Talking with Cerberus. <coughs> Some of these I do not understand, but you know, they're there. Praetor Gavar. Omega. Mm-hmm. 
Boom. Kalisa bin Sinan Al Jilani, Citadel. Yep. <laughs> Even if you don't puncture yourself, at least you can see a Krogan just knock her out. <laughs> Sorry. Keeper twenty, Citadel. Yeah, you just see it walking away from a dead Krogan. You have no idea what happened. If the keeper killed him or if the if it died the Krogan died already, or what? You don't know. It's you know. Ilium. And this one is the most important. This proves to you that this Asari here is the father, mother the other the father. I think they call him the father of uh they are not Torsk, Tachanka. And that's just I Okay. Elias Kellum, Omega. <laughs> So funny. Jacob Taylor. Norman oh, great! You can see him just do sit-ups. <sighs> Walk out. Subject zero. Purgatory. Ship now defunct. Mm. Where are they getting the camera images for this? That's my question. How are you doing, Liara? I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. All right. He had top-level access to the Turian and Asari governments. And more than one Solarian Dalatros traded intel. And now it's ours. Right. You're not going to turn into a recluse with creepy information on everyone in the galaxy, are you? I can understand the temptation. I've got all the secrets of the galaxy at my fingertips. Give me ten minutes and I could start a war. We already have but a war coming. Purpose, helping you stop the Reapers. That will keep me honest. <laughs> you know, relatively speaking. <laughs> have you found anything useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. He didn't want Saren to succeed. And yet he was hoping the Collectors. He also knew that the Collectors were Protheans, repurposed to be Harbinger's puppets. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. And it wasn't working very well, was it? Why was he still looking at Protheans? They gave us the warning in the conduit at Ilos, but we've used those. The Shadow Broker seemed to think there was more out there. Perhaps the Protheans had other plans. Or maybe he was just grasping at anything that offered some hope. Maybe. How'd you know what the Shadow Broker was? I didn't. I had no idea what to expect when we finally found him. But I researched pre-space flight cultures during some of my Prothean studies. I know a bit about the Yogg. There's more on the terminals if you want to look. They're a fascinating culture. And a terrifying one. I'm good. Thank How's Baron doing? As well as you'd expect, after two years of intermittent torture. He gonna be okay? I don't know. He wants to work, so I'm letting him help. Maybe it takes his mind off it. Mm. So, you and Farron? No. He's been through a traumatic ordeal. He's emotionally fragile and needs to heal. He's very grateful to me for saving him. But it would be irresponsible of me to take advantage of that. Right. It was good talking with you, Liara. Let me know if you need anything. I think what I need right now is a friend. I can't leave for too long, but spending all my time on this ship. Maybe next time you come by, I could come up to the Normandy. Well, let's do it right now. Why don't you come up now? Okay, thanks. I'll be right there. Just give me a minute.
yeah, there will be no romance, so don't expect that. Just because I'm pouring some wine doesn't mean the romance. Sorry, that was loud. Did you enjoy the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship, and I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me. Although, he did ask if I'd embraced eternity lately. Of course he did. Of course. It's Joker. I also spoke with Dr. Chalkwaz. I'm glad she's doing well. I brought you something. It took some digging, but I recovered your tags. I'd never see these again. They changed hands more than once. Do you remember Admiral Hackett? He gave them to me so I could return them to you. He sends his best and hopes you're okay. So how are you He's doing, He's a good Shepherd? man. I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. Well, to be honest. Between you and me? I have no idea how we're going to do this. I'm doing everything I can, but... You've done more than most. There wouldn't be a man, woman, or child left on Horizon, if not for you. I saved some of them. Not enough. And the Collectors will keep hitting colonies until I stop them. So you'll stop them? And here I thought it'd be difficult. You'll <laughs> get the job done. You always do. I just don't know what comes next. So tell me what you want. What are you fighting for? I guess I'm fighting for us. All of us. That's a lot of responsibility. People are messy, awkward, sometimes selfish or cruel. But they're trying, and I'm gonna make sure they have a chance. I hope the galaxy proves itself worthy of the effort you're putting into saving it. I should get back to my base, but thanks for inviting me up, Shepard. Uh, of course. Bye-bye. And that, my dear Thanks. friends, is the Shadow Broker DLC. And it is also the end of this video. I'm hoping I'll be able to do it and edit it because this feels like it was a very long episode. So who knows? I hope you all enjoy this video. If you did, please hit that like button down below. Subscribe and ring that bell icon for notifications of my next uploads. I hope you all have a great day and a fantastic week. See ya.